What's up guys? This is a little video that I wanted to put together to describe a little feature that YouTube has. It's not available on every video, but it seems to be available on a lot of mine. And it is transcribe audio. If you look right next to where the, I guess, setting is to change the uh, quality, like up to 1080p, 720, etc. Right next to it, down in that bottom right corner, is a little button that has CC on it. What this is is closed captions. Uh, once you click it, it turns on closed captions for videos that have it available. Uh, but if you click it again after, you know, the first click, it gives you the option of choosing transcribe audio. What this is, is Google's attempt to uh, make a program that can listen to the audio inside of a video and try its very best to make captions on what it hears. Now, the best thing about it is it does a terrible, terrible job at this, and it is so entertaining to watch some videos. You turn that on, and you listen to people, and you look at the captions that pop up, and they don't match at all, and they can give some of the most strangest, most ridiculous captions you have ever seen. And it could be pretty funny, uh, especially if you're watching somebody who's really serious and just gets all this random crap in the bottom corner. And I decided to use this game because the introduction has a lot of talking, Wheatley talks, etc, etc. And I wanted to see if it could pick up on that and what it actually thinks Wheatley's saying. So I'm going to hop into single player here, uh, create a new game. And yeah, let's find out. I guess there's not going to be anything on a loading screen, so obviously it'll pick up on my voice. What I'm saying right now, it, it'll it think of some random crap that it thinks I'm saying and put it down at the bottom of the screen there if you have it on. And it's just so stupid. It's so, so very stupid. But it's an interesting little piece of tech. Good morning. You have been in suspension for 50 days. In compliance with state and federal regulations, all testing candidates in the Aperture Science Extended Relaxation Center must be revived periodically for a mandatory physical and mental wellness exercise. Hooray! You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, look up at the ceiling. <coughs> Good. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, look down at the floor. This carpet sucks! Good. This completes the gymnastic portion of your mandatory physical and mental wellness exercise. There is a framed painting on the wall. Please go stand in front of it. See, I'm wondering if it can actually pick up on that voice. It's pretty quiet for me, as well as a bit distorted, so... This is art. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, stare at the art. I'm already staring at it! You should now feel mentally reinvigorated. <laughs> if you suspect staring at art has not provided the required intellectual sustenance, Reflect briefly on this classical music. Fuck it, buzzer. Good. Now, please return to your bed. Oh. My God. And then Wheelie comes in short. You have been in suspension for nine, 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 nine. Hello? Anyone in there? Hello? Are you going to open the door? At any time? Hopefully he can pick up on his voice. Ah! Ah! Oh, God. You look... Um... Good. Looking good, actually. Are you okay? Are you... Don't answer that. I'm absolutely sure you're fine. There's plenty of time for you to recover. Just take it. Please sleep. prepare for emergency evacuation. Stay calm. Stay, stay calm. Prepare. It's all the same. Prepare. It's all fine. All right. Don't move. I'm going to get us out of here. Oh, you might want to hang on to something. Word of advice. Up to you. <laughs> you all right down there? Can you hear me? Hello? Why can't I go into this closet? 
Invisible closet door. Most test subjects do experience some uh, cognitive deterioration after a few months in suspension. Now, you've been under for quite a lot longer, and it's not out of the question that you might have a very minor case of serious brain damage. But don't be alarmed, all right? Uh, although if you do, if you do feel alarmed, try to hold on to that feeling because that is the proper reaction to being told that you've got brain damage. Do you understand what I'm saying at all? Does any of this make any sense? Just tell me. Just say yes. Did the art change? Yeah. Okay. What you're doing there is jumping. Uh, you just you just jumped. But never mind. Say apple. Apple. Go fuck yourself. Okay, you know what? That's close enough. Just hold tight. All reactor core safeguards are now non-functional. I want to use a microwave. For reactor core meltdown. Okay, look, I wasn't going to mention no. this to you. No, 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 microwave. I'm pretty hot Stay. water here. How are you doing down there? You still holding on? The reserve power ran out. So, of course, the whole relaxation center oh. stops waking up the bloody test subjects. Oh. Hold nope, on. microwave. It's a bit tricky. And of course, nobody tells me anything. No, why should you tell me anything? Why should I no. get informed? You know, about the life functions of the 10,000 bloody test subjects I'm supposed to be in charge of. Is it still here? Why? It's close. Can you see? Mm, I'm going to make it through. But I love space. Uh, just, just got to get through here. Okay, I just got to concentrate. And whose fault do you think it's going to be when the management comes down here and finds 10,000 flipping vegetables? Oh, Another invisible wall. I hear that one. Okay, listen, we should get our story straight, all right? If anyone asks, and no one's going to ask, don't worry, but if anyone asks, tell them as far as you know, the last time you checked, everyone looked pretty much alive, all right? Not dead. Okay. Almost there. On the other side of that wall is one of the old testing tracks. There's a piece of equipment in there that we're going to need to get out of here. I, I think this is a docking station. 500 feet. Good news. That is not a docking station. So there's one mystery solved. Uh, I'm going to attempt a manual override on this wall. Could get a bit technical. Hold on. Ooh. Almost there. Remember, you're looking for a gun that makes holes, not bullet holes. But don't worry, you'll figure it out. Seriously, do hold on this time. Success. Oh, there we go. Now, I'll be honest, you are probably in no fit state to run this particular type of cognitive gauntlet. But um, at least you're a good jumper. So you got that, you got the jumping on your side. Um, just do your best and I'll meet you up ahead. No. That's the spirit. I don't feel like waiting for all this random dialogue. Welcome to the Aperture Science Enrichment Center. We are currently experiencing technical difficulties due to circumstances of potentially apocalyptic significance beyond our wow. control. Wait. However, thanks to emergency technical protocols, testing the... can continue. These pre-recorded messages will provide instructional and motivational support so that science can still be done, even in the event of environmental, social, economic, or structural collapse. What? The portal will open, and emergency testing will begin in three, two, one. I'm sorry, Val. Your physics for this clipboard are retarded. I just saw it fly out of the toilet. Come on. Come on. So yeah, I'm just gonna go through this first test. There we go. Once he quits talking. There we are. So yeah, this is just the. Uh, like I said, I don't even know if you guys watch this far through the video. But if you have transcribe audio on, I'm sure some funny things were said. I obviously don't know what is going to happen with it right now since the making of the video. 
I'll have to upload it, and then I'll watch it myself to see what kind of random crap comes up from Wheatley. So, yeah, there we go. That's transcribe audio. You can use this on a whole lot of different videos, and it could be pretty entertaining. Pretty entertaining. <laughs>